In May, a huge tornado ripped across Oklahoma and in the aftermath, CBS News captured a heartwarming moment. And I hollered for my little dog and he didn't answer. A dog. Hi, puppy. A dog. Oh. This being the oh. Bible Belt, many thought this kind of thing demonstrated faith in action. Well, I thought God just answered one prayer to let me be okay. He answered both of them. But not everyone who survived the hurricane was God-fearing, as one notably illuminating exchange demonstrated. I guess you got to thank the Lord, right? Yeah. Do you thank the Lord for that split-second decision? I, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm actually an atheist. Oh, you are. All right. Sounds like <laughs> If you think that didn't take balls, you've never been to Oklahoma. Saying I'm an atheist in Oklahoma is like screaming jihad at airport security. That took some nuts. And you watch the footage, all the other victims are on the news thanking Jesus for only killing their neighbors and not them, while a crawler is on the screen telling me where I can text money to help them out. Fuck them. I don't want Jesus getting credit for my $50. I'll help that other girl out that CNN's exploiting. Hell yes, she ain't got no Jeebus. She gonna need money. So I did. I started an Indiegogo fundraiser account and atheists ended up ponying up over $126,000 just for little old her. And I couldn't get the smile off of my face for a week. And I didn't do it because I felt sympathy because she got all her shit destroyed by a tornado. I did it simply to be a prick to her oaky Christian neighbors, hoping that they were still eating off of FEMA trucks when someone drove up and presented Rebecca with a giant cardboard check. It's funny how hate can make you do real nice things every now and then.